So hey guys, I have a really really big haul for you guys. I just said it twice, but anyway. Um, I have a lot of books and a lot of different things that I'm going to show you. So I'll show you some things quickly so I can clear the space. Uh, the first two things that I got was, um, I got the OC Season 2 mail to me. I think I paid $23 or something for it. I think 30 all up with postage and handling. So that's that. Uh, and then I went and bought Gossip Girl the second season because I absolutely loved the first season of Gossip Girl and I had to get the next one. And then I went to a lot of different places because I went to the city again for two days and um, picked up some stuff. I picked up this little. Uh, notepad thingy at a convenience store it's naturalism there is always faith hope faith hope and charity and the greatest of them is charity and I just thought it was really cute so I'm gonna stick that on my desk then I got a little black book for a dollar from typo and I had an inkling it was gonna be a dress book but whatever I could still use it it's like a liver then I got a Buffalo um, journal, which is, if you guys know anything about moleskins, it's like that. It's leather. It's, um, I don't, it won't show up very well, but this is blue. Got a really nice dark blue. And inside it's lined, and at the back, just like a moleskin, it has a pocket. So, a really good quality journal, and I think I paid $15 for this one as opposed to moleskins which are like twenty thirty dollars so that and then for three dollars at borders I picked up this like um journal that has jean denim jean jeans and on the back as well and it's just lined pages and then um I picked up this card for my partner for Valentine's Day Love you lots, Valentine. I don't really believe in Valentine very much, but we both love cats, and I saw this card, and I just had to pick it up for him. And I got my scrapbooking magazine this month, which also came with two free ones, which I've already got before, but I always like using the ideas and stuff to make my own projects. Um, also at Borders, I picked up this cup. They didn't really actually have any other ones except plain ones, and I didn't really want a plain one. So, it's one of those silicone cups with the plastic tops. And, yeah. And, yes, yeah, so that was pretty cool. I think I paid, like, $14, and it was down from $20. Um, what else have I got? I got jewellery. I got these angel earrings. For five dollars, this bracelet, this wrist bracelet, um, and these two floral headbands because I like floral stuff, floral headbands and jewelry. Jewelry, I can't say jewelry. And then um, I also picked up a tin of paper clips again and these were like three dollars these were on special for three dollars sorry about my leg you don't want to see my legs if I can get it open. and this one has like a bird and shit and busy so I thought they were cool, pretty cute, and I like the tins, and I can always use the tins for something else afterwards as well. I also got this um, bag for $2 that says keep calm and carry on shopping. And I got this little thing, I can't remember what it's called. I can't remember what his name is, but I just 
said his name's retard spastic guy Chris no that's not really nice but um he is like really retarded and so he's cute though so he was on my um, bag but I was carrying around so much money that it snapped off so yeah I also got some other stuff but I won't show you guys that because they're probably young adults and teenagers on this um, checking out my videos and I don't really don't want to show that because it's just kind of wrong so yeah, I think you guys can probably picture what I picked up but anyway I have no shame um, the first few books I got are from Big W and they are Pretty Little Liars, the first book by Sarah Shepard. I hate this cover. I fucking, sorry, but I really do. I freaking hate these covers so, so much. Like, they're so ugly. And I know, no, it's not that the girls are ugly or anything like that. I just don't like them. I want colourful, happy ones, but, um, yeah. I couldn't afford to get them shipped, so I had to start with this, this one. Well, I could afford it, but not at the time, so, anyway. Um, I think you guys pretty much know what little Pretty Little Lies is about, so I won't go into detail about that. And I got this book called Once in a Full Moon by Ellen Schreiber. Schreiber. This is the first in the Full Moon series. Um, she also has a vampire series that I have to start as well. But I saw this and it was like, I think it cost me $10, so I picked it up. And it's pretty. Um, I'll read you the back. Um, beware of a kiss under the full moon it will change your life forever Celeste Parker is used to hearing scary stories about werewolves L Legends Run is famous for them Legends Run is famous for them she's used to she used to every uh, she's used to everything in a small town until a mysterious Brandon Maddox uh, moves to Legends Run Despite already having the perfect boyfriend, Celeste finds herself immediately drawn to the handsome new student. After a chance encounter one late one night with a pack of wolves, Celeste is rescued by gorgeous, enigmatic Brand Brandon. Is Brandon's transformation a trick of the shadow in the moonlight, or is, it, is there more werewolf stories of legends run? Praise for Vampire Kisses series. Yeah. I don't know if it's part of the series or not, but I hope, yeah, I hope I wasn't, like, angling it down that far, because that's just wrong. So, I'm very all over the place. I only just got back, and I had to go pay bills and shit. Anyway, so that's that. And I got Mercy, Exiled from Heaven, A Lost Soul Seeks Her Soulmate, by Rebecca Lim. And I can use this for my challenge, my 2011 challenge, which I'm going to do a video on as well. Isn't that pretty? Um, she's an Australian writer, so I can do that. Uh, the story is, uh, Mercy wakes on a school bus bound for paradise, a small town where everyone knows everyone else's business, or they think they do, or thinks they do, but they will never guess the secret Mercy is hiding. As an angel exiled from heaven and doomed to return repeatedly to earth, Mercy is never sure whose life and body she will share each time and her mind is filled with the desperate pleas of her beloved Luke Luck Luke who can only approach her in her dreams. In Paradise Mercy meets Ryan, whose sister was kidnapped two years ago and is now presumed dead. When another girl disappears, Mercy and Ryan know they must act before t time runs out. But a host of angels are out for Mercy's blood and they won't rest until they find her and punish her for a crime she doesn't even remember committing. An electric com combination of angels, mystery and romance. Mercy is the first book in a major new series. So. And it's my favourite colour too so I could not pass it up. And see it's all glittery. And then I got blah, 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 blah. The Card Turner by Lewis Saxetcher, a novel about a king, a queen, and a joker. And my mother puts her hands on my shoulders, looked me straight in the eye, and gave me her best motherly advice: "Don't screw it up, Elton." And I believe this is about um, 
Actually, I think it's got, it's hard to cover. Oh, yeah. Um, a teenage boy, a rich uncle, an attractive girl, and a mother who is waiting for her inheritance create a heady cocktail of intrigue and excitement in this excellent novel by Lewis Satcher. So, I won't read that part, though, because I don't know how much time I have in my camera. But, um, actually, no, I will. I will. I will. I'll make another video. Um, when Alton's aging blind uncle asks him to attend bridge games with our, with him, Alton agrees, mainly because his mother reminds him it is good to be on the right side of your rich uncle. Not expecting much from the outgoings, Alton soon finds himself getting to know a lot, not only about his uncle and his family's history, but also about himself. As one mystery unfolds, another is discovered in his brilliant funny novel that is a fantastic addition to Lewis Satcher's list of books. And then I'll do these ones and I'll do, actually I'm going to make a separate video for these next ones. So look forward to that.